So women and created this list, y'all. The pushback, y'all. The put they didn't push back. They got the list. I don't know if y'all can see it, but I'm about to read it out to y'all. Stephen A. The Streets, or these YouTube streets as well. Hassan Ramble, Charleston Black. But today I'm bringing you Devin Samuels. Okay. Um, when I launched this attack right here, uh, I'm not bashing women. You know, it's a lot of dudes out here going through this. Clearly, this is a thing, even with this list coming back with the Cheesecake Factory and everything. But people going to say I'm woman bashing. I'm just doing my due diligence as a YouTuber. I get a lot of views off me lacing these dudes. And a lot of dudes need to know this and need to hear this. So anybody that know me in real life that feel bad about me making these videos about women and about dating, I apologize. But this is how I blew in the first place. I'm not going to stop doing what I've been doing. I got to keep lacing y'all, lacing these dudes out here. First of all, if a woman subject herself to this list and she really considering this list, like, like, like ladies, if you didn't, if you didn't click on here, if you're a female and you're looking on here or, or, or uh, oh boy, if you know a girl that's talking about this list and she's really considering this list, if she ain't seen this list and been like, man, this, this shit crazy. If she's really going by this list, something wrong with her sweetheart if you go on by this list something is wrong with you go talk to big mama go talk to your auntie or something you know what i'm saying uh the fact that the cheesecake factory is number one lets you know the pushback that women coming with now like i like i i had a video kevin wesley featured it on on kevin wesley is a big youtuber he featured what i said and one of the things I said on there was a lot of women acting like this, not them. A lot of women acting like, oh, man, I can't believe she did that. She messing with the culture. But it's like, y'all like this. Wait a minute. Like, no, 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 no. Y'all are like this. It's like a dude, it's like a female bashing dude for being a player and a bunch of dudes like, oh, man, y'all know how. Y'all know some of these niggas ain't shit. Stop playing. We know some of these females. And, come on, stop, man. And and you see the list, Cheesecake Factory. Look at the pushback. Since y'all going to make a whole Cheesecake Factory video and act like and, and, and we're going to demonize this girl, the pushback we're going to give is to, to, you know, slap you right in your face like Cheesecake Factory is number one on the list. Like, look at, look at how the list is really, the list was just created. See, women are good at pissing people off. Women are good at pushing buttons and making. That's that's like that's one of their ta I give hey, that's the talent of a woman to make you mad. Some of them do it naturally without even knowing it, and some of them do it on purpose. And some of them do it uh and play dumb and act like they don't know. Some of them do all three of them at the same time. But this right here shows you how strong and how stubborn and how self-centered and how lost. This dating society and how lost women are. Some women, I'm not bad, but how lost. Even the ones that's not like that. Y'all know y'all got a, got a homegirl that's talking to you about this list. The Cheesecake Factory is number one. Now, let us let me say, like, the Cheesecake Factory got meals from $13 all the way up to $100. But see, the reason why they want to eliminate the Cheesecake Factory because it's like, oh, I don't want to. I don't want to order a $50 meal, $75 meal, and seem like I'm doing too much. I want to go someplace where the meals is already $75. I don't want to be put the put the weight on my shoulders to pick something that costs $20, $25. You know what I'm saying? And best believe the dude sitting there, really the Cheesecake Factory really is a good place to go because get this. I could see if you're gonna get the hundred dollar one. This is just an interview. This is this is this is just a date. See, that's what uh, the people put too much weight in a, in the first date. Anyway, let me let me keep going. Applebee's. What's wrong with Applebee's? Oh, the food at Applebee's going to swallow just like the rest of the food. Applebee's is a good, inexpensive place. You know what I'm saying? And then that's another thing that y'all not knowing, too. When dudes be taking y'all on dates, how you know it's not? Like, like a dude could take you on a date and not even really want to, like, a dude could just be doing something. So y'all putting too much weight into these dates, but some dude, dudes that got money and all that, I'm speaking from a mid-level perspective. I'm not speaking from a rich dude's perspective. You know, uh, a dude that got money and all that, he he ain't really he 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 ain't tripping off 
where to go and do and all of that. He just all he trying to do is is we can go to expensive place, small place. I'm just trying to see like where your mind is at and what kind of place you going to pick. How you going to feel? Like really dates dudes be having their own uh they own thing going too in their head when they take you on dates too. You want all this crazy stuff on the first date, but a dude might not necessarily like be putting that much into it. He might just be taking you out because he ain't got nothing to do. And you taking this like a life or death thing and you got so much weight on the first date and this nigga just bored. Anyway, Chipotle. What's wrong? I mean, at the end of the day, look, I could see if you're a high maintenance woman and Chipotle, like, so I could see how Applebee's and chili and, and chilies and Chipotle and number five, Olive Garden. I mean, it's nothing wrong with the Olive Garden. It's not, it's good food at the Olive Garden. The ambiance is cool. Ambiance, however you say. If we just trying to get to know each other. Bottom line, we just trying to get to know each other, man. All this weight on, we can go anywhere, really. If you into me, uh, I'm gonna just say them all real quick. The movies. What's wrong with the movies? Damn. I mean, damn. The movies was a staple. Like the movies was like, uh, let's, go, let's go hit a movie. I don't like to do movies that much because I can't really talk to nobody doing the movies. We're just sitting there watching the movie. And then if it's a female that want to go right home, if, if the date is just to the movies and home, then it's like you're wasting your, you're kind of wasting your time at a movie. Uh, your house. I mean, some females that just really into you and want, and, and hey, look, I, I want to skip the date. I re, I'm really fucking with you. See, some of these places that, that we name and if a female really fuck with you, she'll do it. You know, niggas have been in situations where they didn't met you at the house and then y'all went somewhere after that. You know, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, any fast food chain, I kind of could see that. You know what I'm saying? But it just depends. And keep in mind, it just depends on how much she rock with you. Because if a female really rock with you, she really fucking with you, y'all can go anywhere. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can go over y'all cousin's house and sit on the couch if she really rock with you. Um, wing stop. Once again, nothing really much. Red, red Lobster. I told y'all Red Lobster completely out the question. I hop. Yeah, I mean, but if we coming from the club and we kind of drunk, I hop do be hitting. Uh, Denny's do be hitting the gym. See, I'm a personal trainer. I lift weights. If you don't want to go to the gym, that's kind of like a bad. That's that's that's. I don't. Mm, I don't really. I don't really know how to feel about that. Church. What's wrong with church, man? What's wrong with church? But to me, church is like the movies where we can't really enjoy each other. We're going to be sitting up looking at the pastor. And you don't take a girl to church that's ready to, oh, pastor, this, I need to talk to pastor right after church. So you never know. That church stuff can get kind of root, can get kind of weird. Starbucks, coffee dates, that's kind of the same thing. Uh, what's so crazy is I think that's one of the ones where some girls probably like, I, I wouldn't mind going to Starbucks because it's that fake little setup where we're spending some little money on some expensive coffee. Ice cream. What's wrong with ice cream? Family functions. You ain't coming around my family anyway. You know what I'm saying? But if I, you know, you ain't coming around my family for a long time anyway. But some dudes, what's wrong with going to kick it with the fam? You know? Um, movie night. If Like I say, if a female really into you, she gonna do movie night. Netflix, Hulu, she gonna do that. Somewhere that requires a long drive. If you want to go to one of these extravagant places, we're gonna have to drive far anyway. So that don't, that don't really make no sense. Bowling. That's a Come on, man. We could laugh, chop it up. Bowling alley, one of them combos. You might go to the bowling alley, then go somewhere. So if a dude, what if a dude hits you with a combo like bowling and like chilies? That's a cool. See, some dudes know how to navigate. Okay, I'm going to take her to two, not real cheap places, but not expensive, but I'm going to take her to two of them. So we can go to bo we can go bowl and go to chilies. Nightclub, I ain't trying to fight nobody that's trying to get on you in front of me or you trying to flirt with somebody. You don't want to take a girl to a nightclub. I'm just telling you, you don't take your your girl or girl you dating to the nightclub. Hookah bars, I don't even know what's the point of a hookah bar. I I, I wouldn't want to take you to a hookah bar anyway. Uh, let me see. Waffle House, I don't really fool a Waffle House. Sports events, what's wrong with a sports event? Sports event is that, like, that's that's a place you can go that's not like church or the movies where y'all can interact, talk, cheer for the game, interact with other... It, it's... Anyway, this list is crazy, man. This is just, this list is crazy. I don't even understand. I think part of it, you know, you got to understand a lot of this stuff be like social media and like to strike a nerve. It's not really real. A lot of these places on here, women will really go. 
I'm speaking for the women that's not caught up in all that. So a lot of these places, women will go with y'all, man. They will. Like, it, it, it's this list is stupid. Like, what if they do two things on that list? And like I say, if you concerned with more of the list than me, you tripping anyway. And see, I didn't, don't get it twisted. I'm going to tell y'all a story real quick. And this this right here kind of crazy. This this is first date. This kind of this kind of out of nowhere. I had to take this girl on this date, right? And she really liked me. And um when we went there, I'm not even we go we went to like we went I, I think uh we went to some little bar and stuff, right? Now this now I, I don't y'all I mean y'all tell me if I'm right or wrong. I might have been wrong for this, but when we go on a date the girl gets some drinks, gets some food. I get some drink, get some food. She feeling me. She we didn't met on like an online thing. She feeling me though. She really feeling me. So on the date, we chopped it up. The date went cool. Everything. I could tell she was a little materialistic, but I wasn't. I'm like, see, I don't put too. I don't see. I don't mind being alone. I I I I love like you know like I wouldn't mind. I'm, I'm a man that play video games. I work out. I watch sports. It's a lot of stuff I could do. But um, so I don't when I when I go on first dates. I don't really, it's not life or death for me. I could, something could easily go left within you and make me not want to talk to you ever again. It, it, no matter how cool, no matter how cool we is, no matter how cool we hit it off, if you could show me something to let me know in the future, you're going to be a problem. But like this girl, she was like, after the day was over, she offered to go Dutch. So I'm like, in my mind, I'm like, okay. Like this is how crazy it was. I thought she was feeling me because she asked to go Dutch. I thought she was feeling me. So we I, I, I uh we go Dutch. So afterwards I call her, she's not picking up the phone. So I'm like, damn, what's up? So she finally get in touch with me like three days later. She like, yeah, um, the fact that we went Dutch, it just made me like it was a turn off to me. And you know what I'm saying? I just rather not. And I was like, okay, you know. Okay, bet. I thought I told her I said I thought you was going Dutch because you was fucking with me. I could have paid for the food. I just I thought you was like, man, I'm really feeling you. Let's go Dutch. I didn't see, but see the game she was willing to play, just playing games. Then she hit me up like, man, I really want to talk to you. I was tripping for going Dutch. For I was tripping for I was tripping for tripping off you for going Dutch. And I was like, nah, it's it's cool. See, that's what I'm saying. I didn't put that. I wasn't tripping. I wasn't tripping. You messed up. I'll take somebody else on another date and hopefully they won't make that mistake, but they might make it too. Cause it's war out here. These women crazy, but she was like, no, I was sure. I was like, you, you shouldn't have, you shouldn't have played them games with me. So uh, I'm telling you right now, women, if you fooling with a man that really got purpose and really ain't tripping and know it's a lot of women out here, that's why God made so many people. And you do something like bring up this list or go by this list. It's, it's, I'm telling you right now, this list for the mess up, it's going to be a lot of lonely women and a lot of toxicity and just a lot of bullshit just from this list, man. If you're going by this list out here, you tripping, man.